Howdy guys, lovely to see you all again. Today we're going to be looking at a blast from the past, a disappointing lesson I did in 2012. I'm redoing it again in HD with some tabs. We're going to be looking at the Steel Panther Classic Death to All But Metal. Let's take a look. Alright guys, before we get too excited, we just need to talk about the tuning, which is E-flat standard, which goes E-flat, A-flat, D-flat, G-flat, B-flat, and another E-flat. So get yourself in tune, and we'll get started. Alright guys, let's have a look at the first section. I'm going to start off with three tone and a half bends from 22 of the second string. At the end of that... Just a full tone bend from 20. I do believe Satchel might actually do them all from 20. So that's a two and a half tone bend, which is super slinky strings and uh, something that uh, us mere mortals cannot do. But this is a good way around it. Three 22 bends and a 20 bend. Hopefully that's making sense. Then I work into this phrase. Essentially, it's an A minor pentatonic uh, in this high position. I do have... Um, a second in there which is not characteristic of the pentatonic and also a cheeky flat five so it still feels like a pentatonic and it is mainly two note per string riff we're going to start off with this I'm starting off with a hammer on from 17 to 20 on the second string and then 17 19 17 on the first string is a hammer on pull off all together and then I want to go right up to 20 of the second string so all together from this point, I'm kind of working in descending fours. I think we saw this lick in a solo builder a few weeks ago, if you remember that. So we've got this. Now I'll start working through our descending fours. We're gonna do it four notes at a time. I'll start from 17 of the first string. Then I'm gonna pull off 20, 17 on the second string and land on 20 of the third. From that point, I'm going to do 17 to 20 on the second and third string, and both of them are going to have pull-offs. So let's have a look at those two groups of four. Then we go... So this is quite predictable once you get the idea. I'm going to start from 17 of the second string, and then play 20, 17 on the third to 19 of the fourth, nice and slow. The end of that. So what I'm doing here is I'm going to be doing a pull off from 20 to 17 on the third string and then 19, 17 on the fourth. So let's go right back to the start of that little chunk now. We'll add the uh, little uh, 17, 19 on the first string as well. So this is what we should have thus far. Okay, then from that point, I'm going to go to 17 of the third string, pull off 19, 17 on the fourth and end on 19 of the fifth. To finish that, I've got a pull off from 19 to 17 on the fourth, and that's resolving to 17 of the third. So from the last four notes and then three notes, we're going to have this. And that's all of the first section. Let's try and do it nice and slowly, and then we'll do it again even slower with some tabs. One more time with some tabs. All right, guys, let's have a look at the second section. We're going to start with this cheeky pull off leg. So let's take out the open notes for a second and just have a look at what we're actually fretting. I'm going to be playing five, seven, eight on the third string and then nine, eight, seven. So we're gonna have, if I put a pull off uh, open note in between there, we're pulling off on the G or the third string, we're gonna have this. Hopefully that's making sense. And then the next one is uh, quite chromatic. I'm gonna play five, six, seven, eight. When I get to nine this time, instead of pulling to the open note, I'm gonna slide to five. So let's try the whole thing thus far nice and slow, and then we'll do it at a regular speed. Go 
hopefully that's all making sense. Then we go back to the A minor pentatonic that we had at the start in this higher position. Uh, the start of it is quite similar to the other part and we're just doing a big bend into a descending pentatonic run. Let's slow that down. Tone and a half bend from 20 of the first string. I go back to 17 and then from this point, just working down the A minor pentatonic, I'm playing 2017 on the second string, 2019, 17 on the third. So it's got the cheeky flat five there and we're just rolling through and then resolving to 19 of the fourth string. So all together, hopefully that's all making sense. And then we go into this phrase, which is actually kind of similar to the first section, just sort of the four note groupings. So I've got a bend here. Uh, from 20 of the second string and then I'm going to be playing 17 of the second pulling off 19 17 of the third and then 19 of the fourth all together of that chunk now we're going to repeat those notes from that 17 of the second string this time though I'm going to add in one more note by pulling off to nine from 19 to 17 on the fourth so we're going to have this at the end of that I'm gonna play 19 of the fifth string and give it some angry whammy. So all together of that last chunk. Hopefully that's all making sense. Let's try the pull off lick at the start into the A minor pentatonic lick and then we'll do it again even slower with some tabs. One more time with some tabs. my remake of death to orbit metal by steel panther hope you guys enjoyed the lesson please like and subscribe if you haven't done so already and if you want tabs to the lesson please join up with my patreon posse there's a lot of extra content like tabs and backing tracks albums giveaways lessons all that fun stuff if you join up with that also have a couple of courses on udemy and if you want to check out my book ultimate shred machine it is out now if you want to up your chops in shredding sweeping legato and tapping anyway hope you guys enjoyed the lesson there will be more delightful shreds coming very soon I'll catch you guys all very soon